I've always had challenges budgeting my money. If I could put myself in description, it would be that I'm a train wreck when it comes to finances. We were struggling every month and there was just tension and I was living with a lot of shame and I do find now that there's just, I have found a lot of freedom. The seven money types represent the seven ways that God has created us in His image to think, feel, and act financially. What's fascinating is that those seven types are actually represented in Scripture by seven major characters, Abraham, Isaac, Jacob, Joseph, Moses, Aaron, and David. As we take the time to learn from each of those types, it actually informs our own story about how and why we think, feel, and act the way that we do financially. So as we understand ourselves better, and actually as we're able to understand other types better, this resolves a great amount of financial tension that we experience both internally and in our most treasured relationships. I couldn't wait to delve in. When my husband and I would read it, we couldn't wait to read the next one. We're like, I just want to find out what this one is, especially after um, if you weren't that type. If it, when he wasn't Abraham, he was like, I can't wait to get to Moses. I want to see what I, if I'm Moses. It has really helped me to be open-minded to how other people use their money and that it opened up a different facet of humanity that another way to relate to people instead of everybody doing it the same way. Everybody is different, but it's all for kingdom work. The Seven Money Types is a unique book because it starts with the inside of a person's life and it works its way out. Most other books that are out there on the shelf today are gonna start with behavior modification, external realities, and they may work their way inside. So sure, they can help people get things right in terms of beating debt, saving, amassing wealth, all of those things, that's all great. But this book actually starts with internal realities, helping you find out who you are and how you relate to money so you can better understand other people and how they relate to money as well. You will pick up this book, you will read it, and you will from the beginning uh, begin to understand who you are uh, in the way that God has wired you in your relationship uh, to something that we deal with every day, which is money and finances. I would recommend somebody to get this book if they want to gain insight into themselves and their loved ones and how they handle money beyond just the dollars and cents and why they do what they do.